see one beside the pillow the female killer. You are listening at fametv.info. Yuner. The man on the bed opened his eyes. When he saw the empty space in the crook of his arm, his amber eyes revealed a hint of unease every day when he opened his eyes, his woman would be in his arms, smiling as she said good morning to him, the man sat up, and the black blanket fell down on his waist, revealing his proud, honey. Colored body. His amber eyes scanned the room, and his handsome face, which was mixed with the appearance of east and west, was immediately filled with surprise, his daughter would never leave his sight in the morning. It was a strange day that he stood up and walked to the window. He opened the heavy curtain and the morning sunlight poured into the luxurious European-style bedroom, looking out of the window of the manor, the elegant voice of the band could be heard. The white roses were blooming in full bloom. The man looked down at the flower path condescendingly, trying to find the figure of the woman he loved, today was the day that he, Huang Fu Yunyun, and Song Yuner were getting married. The manor was bustling with noise, gathering the world's most powerful men and women that he was the president of the Huangfu Corporation. A single sneeze would cause the earth to tremble, and there was no need to hide his identity. Huangfu Group was the empire state building of the global underworld, and he, Huangfu Yunin, was the unstoppable king of this empire that caused people to be afraid of him. Knock, come in. Suddenly, there was a light knock on the door. Huang Fu Yun didn't even turn his head as he spoke in a low voice. CEO, Miss Yuner's image team is here. Miss, get up, as Yuner's close follower, Tian Yi had come to ask if Yuner had woken up. This meant that Song Yuner was not in the manor. Find her, light and shadow floated, the faint fragrance of white roses drifting under the window. Huan Fu Yunyan's voice was as cold and sinister as if he was giving the world a cold and brutal feeling, the guests of Huang Fu Manor gathered in a great celebration, and a commotion was stirred in the darkness that I in less than an hour, a disc was delivered in front of Huang Fu Yun. CEO, this is a video from the surveillance room. Miss Yuner left, Tian Yi led the chief of the security section of Huang Fu Manor's surveillance room, Ming Yu, to stand in front of the gloomy dot-faced Huang Fu Yunian that I in front of the window, the man in Armani's new tailored suit waved his hand and the white porcelain vase on the table shattered with a crash, Tian Yi sucked in a deep breath. CEO, I think it's a good thing that Miss Yuner left by herself. You clearly know that she harbors malicious intentions. She is a killer and wants to kill your people. Scram. Huang Fu Yun's muffled voice was even more terrifying than his angry roar. This subordinate spoke too much. After Tian Yi was startled for a moment, she turned around and led Mingyu, who was shivering on the side, out of the room. It scared me to death. Mingyu stood on the luxurious veranda, his hands pressed on his heart as he whispered dot on the other hand, Tian Yi scolded angrily, it's your luck that you're still alive. The large security department actually allowed Song Yuner to leave just like that. Cousin, you should know that there are so many people going in and out of the CEO's wedding ceremony in the next few days, all right, you don't need to find excuses. Tian Yi frowned as she angrily scolded before turning to leave. She once again stood still and said. Today, you better be more alert. The news has already spread. Someone paid a billion to sell the CEO's life for this wedding banquet. Understood, bang, Mingyu hadn't finished speaking when there was a burst of gunfire, mixed with the sounds of people shouting outside the manor. Security head, why aren't you going? Tiani looked at Mingyu who was at the side and shouted angrily, there were more than a hundred assassins gathered outside the manor. Because the person they wanted to kill was Huang Fu Yunin, the world's most expensive person. This heavy bounty, Huang Fu Yun was alive, it was there. The mystic was making money at a price of 100 million apiece. Thus, Huang Fu Yun became the nectar that attracted the most bees, listening to the gunshots outside the window, he felt as if he was listening to the beautiful singing of a Roman opera house. His long fingers were pinching the transparent crystal cup, and the color of the glass was as red as blood. Looking at the picture on the wall, he saw that the woman's beautiful face had sunk her eyes and swallowed the drop of blood in one gulp. 
Yunar, you love me, right? That's why you left. Yunar, in the orphanage twenty years ago, I was the brother Yun you forgot. Therefore, you are a dangerous person. I still view you as a treasure. Listen to the full novel at fametv.info, direct link in the description.